Um, so I'm Rajiv Ramanathan, Manager Inclusion and Social Procurement on the Level Crossing Removal Project, which is part of a Victorian Government Transport Infrastructure Program delivered by the Major Transport Infrastructure Authority. Yeah, um, look, I was sharing some insights and learnings into how we're trying to create a more diverse and inclusive talent pipeline and supply chain for the transport industry. There's a major pipeline of, of billions of dollars of work um, that's being delivered across Victoria, but there's a critical issue in that we don't actually have enough people to build that, enough people who are qualified and skilled uh, and ready to, to build that. So the Training for the Future program, which is what I was talking about, um, is really trying to create that diverse diverse and inclusive and qualified and, and workforce to build that pipeline. So diversity and inclusion is, is a really critical business case as part of delivering that program of work. Why? Because we've got an ageing workforce, uh, an ageing male workforce, so there's actually more people leaving the industry and retiring than there's people entering into the industry. And so one of the things that we're trying to do is we've identified that there's actually a load of untapped talent pools. So women, trying to get more women into transport, people from Aboriginal backgrounds, people from refugee asylum seeker backgrounds who might bring um, civil engineering and other uh, uh, critical skills to our industry and, and uh, qualifications to our industry. Um, people with disability, people from low socioeconomic backgrounds are trying to give um, all of those people an opportunity to participate because we need them, because we don't actually have enough people to build uh, the transport infrastructure that we need. So um, I think the value for me of the public sector network uh, and this forum that you've delivered is I get to meet other people that I might not necessarily get a, a chance to meet. And also you're bringing in people from uh, across different levels of government for me to meet. Um, so I get to tap into some of um, their ideas, their strategies, things that they've tried, things that they've uh, stumbled on uh, or things that they've failed, but also it just gives me some um, opportunities to innovate, number one, just because I can, I can tap into what, what they've been sharing. So that's really valuable for me as a practitioner. Great, really yeah. enjoyed it. Yeah, yeah, well organised, and um, it's been it's a great op networking opportunity for me and for others. So yeah.